to our Dancing with the Stars Season 22 cast reveal discussion video. Ah! I was excited. I just stepped in. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's get started. She's gagging. All right, so the new season of Dancing with the Stars starts on March 21st. It's a Monday, two weeks from yesterday. Yep, pretty exciting. Len is back. They didn't mention that. We watched yeah, the Good Morning back. America reveal. Julianne Huff will not be back. Get and, out. And neither is Derek Huff. So He's it's doing more important work. The first Huffless season in a while. Wow. It's pretty crazy. That's, that's sad, right. though. No Huffies. <gasps> All right, so <laughs> let's get right to the cast. Let's get to the celebrities and their partners. Ginger Z. Oh. She's dancing with Val. She's the meteorologist for GMA. What? So they have, like... An insider this season. Yes, she just had a baby like mm -hmm. five minutes ago. She didn't even return to Good Morning America. That's yet. crazy. She's gonna have fun. I think she's gonna be fun. Yeah. And she's got Val, so like. And she's gonna have fun. I'm a little jealous. <laughs> I'm a little jealous. She's gonna have to work hard too, though, because Val is like. Yeah, but you know what? She wants to lose that baby weight, and she's gonna lose it in like five minutes dancing with Val. She's gonna look fabulous before when the show starts. All right. Next up. Jody Sweeten with Full Keo. House. Fuller House. Yeah, so Ginger and Jody were already announced, like, before today. Right, right. I don't know if it was just, like, to get people excited or because it was, like, leaked or what, but the two of them were announced ahead of time. Jody Sweeten looks good. She does. She, uh, she aged very well. <laughs> okay. <laughs> From a toddler. And, uh... What has she been doing lately? Has she been doing Fuller anything? House. Okay. So she had like a long period there where she wasn't really... I think so. She was struggling. I'm not totally long. sure, but it's good yeah. to see her back and like, yeah, and ready popular. to go. And I'm yeah. excited because she's with Keo and chances are Keo's going to make it past the first week this yeah. season. Yeah, Keo. I can't Good wait job. to see more of him. I know. I, he's a very, very talented dancer. He is. All right, Antonio Brown is dancing with Sharna. All right, he is a football, He's a football. player. He's a football. <laughs> Pittsburgh Steelers. I don't, I don't remember really what know position too he plays. much about him, and anybody who watches this probably doesn't care, you know, if, what position. I don't know, they might. Pittsburgh Steelers, football. Okay. He's a current player, by the way. Right. He's not retired, so that's something to ponder. He's got an interesting haircut, too. It looks like a little boop. <laughs> <laughs> I think he'll be fun. All right. Paige Van Zant is dancing with Mark Ballas. Marky B. Mark Ballas is going to do a lot of crying without Derek, Derek Huff around to <laughs> uh, partner up with. <laughs> All right. So Paige Van Zant is an MMA fighter. She's ready to kick some ass. She's got a little bit of an advantage, I think. Her uh, parents own a dance studio, and she grew up dancing. What? And I guess she was bullied then and decided to take up uh, mixed martial arts, and uh, so she kick people's butts who annoyed her or bullied her. Use your powers for good. <laughs> yeah. All right. What so, do you think her chances are? Pretty good. Yeah, I mean. Although from the thing on Good Morning America when they had to do like a dance, she wasn't like all that coordinated. Well, maybe she, I don't know. I think you're thinking of somebody else. Maybe. Okay. She'll do fine. I think she'll be good because, you know, she has the dance background, but also the fighting, like there's a rhythm to that and blah, right. blah, 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 right. you know? All right, Wanye Mara. Woo! He's, He's dancing, dancing with Lindsay. Yeah, boys to men. She does not remember Motown Philly. Come on, girl. <laughs> they are the best-selling R&B group of all time. I know other boys to men stuff. I'm a little bit stuff. shocked by that. Why? Because they, well, yeah, I shouldn't be. They've been around forever. They're huge. But I mean, there's other groups, right, that are just like, you know... I can't think of their names because I'm not really that into Motown, but... <laughs> they're not Motown. Yeah, they're Motown. They're R&B. They're R&B. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying anymore. I hurt my back yesterday. <laughs> Are you on something? Okay, but anyway, I think he's going to be exciting to watch. I think yeah. he's going to bring... Uh, now I keep saying this person's going to be fun, but I yeah. really do think that. Yeah. We'll tell you when we don't think somebody's going to be fun. <laughs> Marla Maples is dancing with Tony. Woo, Tone Bones! He didn't get a real housewife. No, that's unusual. That's shocking. But I think it was a height thing. Yeah, I think so too. Otherwise, he would have been with uh, Tootie. Yeah. But we'll get there. <laughs> so Marla Maples, everybody knows from New York anyway, she's the ex-wife of Donald Trump. Oh my God. What? 
And she's actually, that's not just like her only credit. No, she's, she's an like, actress. She's a person. On Broadway, in movies, not that great movies, but still movies. Still movies. Feature films. And uh, she's a philanthropist. Mm -hmm. She's got a daughter with Trump. You know they're going to be talking about Trump so much. The daughter's going to be, like, gonna blah, blah, be blah, blah, blah. there, I'm sure, you know, because she's um, just graduating from college uh, this spring. So it's going to be exciting. What do you think of her? I'm not that familiar with her. I believe she was a dancer before on, like, brought... What? You know, little, not, like, super-duper dance, but she could throw together a few steps. She could do a few time steps? Yeah. Okay. All right. Doug Flutie is dancing with Karina. Woo! He's going to get his butt kicked. Yeah. He's a football legend. Yeah. He's played for, like, a million I teams. recognize this name. <laughs> Didn't he have a cereal out, too, called, like, like, Flutie did, Flakes? right? Yeah, I think, wasn't it to, like, benefit autism? It might have been. He's got a son, I believe, with autism, mm -hmm. and, uh... It's good. I, I'm hoping, like, he's giving his money to charity. That would be awesome. I know he has a foundation for autism. There's so much football on this season. Three former football There's players. There's three footballs! Okay. <laughs> Next up, Misha Barton is dancing with Artem. She is a child star from the OC. You, uh, younger kids might not remember her. We didn't, we didn't watch the OC, but we always used to make fun of her. Yeah. Them. Where have you been, Misha? <laughs> Seriously, it though, like she, she like, the disappeared. for a while. Yeah. And now, you know, she's doing independent stuff, independent films. Indies, so. yeah. That's cool. It's cool to see her back, though. Yeah. Back in the mainstream. Mm hmm uh, Vaughn Miller and Whitney. Whitney always gets some interesting characters. This, this guy. Another football guy. <laughs> from the Denver Broncos. He's the MVP from the Super Bowl. Mm hmm He was the one who had the dirty dance. He which got in trouble. They kept showing on the show this morning, and I was like, no, I do not want to see him humping the air he anymore. He got fined for that, right? I guess. I think he did. And then they they were like, oh, do your winning Super Bowl dance, whatever. And I was like, no, I don't want to see it again. And they did something else. He did else. a different one. Yeah, that was good. <laughs> yeah. All right. I think he's going to be a good dancer. I think so, too. He knows how to hump the air. I think maybe out of the three football players, he's probably going to be the strongest. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, Kim Fields. Tootie, where's Mrs. Garrett? Ah! Facts of life. <laughs> Remember when George Clooney was on that show for like five it's seconds? crazy. I know, I'm right? so excited. I love Kim Fields. She's hilarious. She's short as S, though. And that's why she's dancing with Sasha. <laughs> Finally, someone for Sasha. <laughs> Sasha actually was taller he than was her. He was still taller than her, and she was wearing heels. <laughs> well, now she's on The Real Housewives of Atlanta. What the what? Woo, 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 woo. Exciting. I'd like to see what Tootie's got. Yeah. Wasn't Tootie on, like, um, gosh, what was she on? Surreal Life or Fat Camp I don't know. or Maybe. something like that? It She's was not called Fat show. Camp. <laughs> what was it called? Like Celebrity Boot Camp or boot something. Camp. I don't know. I don't know. I don't think it was called Fat they Camp. They were there to lose weight. All right. Fit Club? Celebrity Fit Club? Yes. Okay. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> How about anyway. that? Anyway, Geraldo oh my God. Rivera. He's really making the reality show rounds now. He is a lucky, lucky piece of crap. He is dancing with Edita. Oh, I'm so excited she's back. She's legendary. Mm -hmm. She really is. I've always admired her so much. She hasn't been on so in a long time. She's great. He's a talk show. He was a talk show host. Maybe he still is. I don't know. But he's been a journalist for like freaking 40 years. He was hilarious on Celebrity Apprentice. It was almost too much. I know. <laughs> I have to wonder, though, how much of that was for the show and, like, True. how much is real. So. I'm thinking he's probably not going to be a great dancer, but you never know. But I'm thinking no. No. And freaking Edita, congratulations. She had a baby. Yeah, like a while ago. Baby, come out. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, that's not her accent. All right. And finally... Niall DeMarco. Ah, <gasps> oh, he's dancing with PETA. Yay, welcome back. He is the winner of America's Next Top Model, the final season. Yes. He's hearing impaired. Uh, I don't know what the hell George Stephanopoulos was talking about. He was like, he's full deaf. <laughs> yeah, what? 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 <laughs> I don't know. It was weird. I. It was so, weird. So, like, other people aren't deaf enough? Marley <laughs> Madeline was not deaf enough? I, it was, yeah, it was a strange that comment. That was really weird. But anyway. <sighs> He's an actor. 
And the best part, he's going to be on Difficult People with Billy Eichner. Love it. Oh my god. Love it. I'm excited to see how he does. He, he seems like a really cool guy. Is hot. <laughs> yes. No, because like some models, they take beautiful pictures, but like in they're real too life, weird. they're weird. You know, they're not like traditionally beautiful. Yeah. But he's like, he's a little amazing. <laughs> All right. So, like we said, this premieres Monday, March 21st. Yep. Leave it in the comments. Let us know who you're excited for. Who do you think is going to do really great? Mm hmm. And until next time, much, much love. love. Edit.